We are going to go over the hip circles on the ball a little more in depth. We're gonna sit on that ball, lengthen through the torso. Our abs are drawn in and our tailbone is dropped to start. So from here, you're gonna tilt your pubic bone to the spine and notice that I'm not collapsing forward when I do this, as we discussed. I stay lifted in my torso. So we go pubic bone to the spine. We go to the sits bone, all the way around, coming back in the front with the pubic bone towards the spine. So you, as you can see from the side when I do this, my torso stays really lifted up and then I'm not collapsing forward at any time throughout this exercise. Your range of motion might be more limited and that is fine. As you progress and you do the exercises and you have better alignment and more mobility in your pelvic floor, you will begin to get more range of motion as well. It's not necessary to collapse forward to really get that pubic bone to the spine. It's really limiting for a lot of women in that position at first. 